Are you feeling anxiety about the holidays? Are you feeling like everyone's out there having a good time preparing for the adventures of the holidays, listening to the music, Christmas carols and watching Hallmark movies? And yet you can't feel like you can't get into the feel of what's going on because it doesn't make sense to you. Are you feeling like you're in a dark place as if, oh, no, I really don't want to go to the holidays. I don't want to spend time with family this year. Or I just don't want to be alone. I feel so isolated. This time of the year is a time of the year all over statistics show it's an increased time for suicide and this series is about awareness and prevention and I know it's not that this is a time for happiness it's the end of the year it's a time to celebrate right but there's so many people out there who are afraid, are scared, are lonely, and are in such a dark place they don't know where to turn. So this is for you out there. If you feel like there's no way to turn, or you have suicidal tendencies, or suicidal ideation, or what if you've experienced a loved one who has died by suicide and you stuck behind with all the emotions, how do you deal with it? So I've, I've spoken to, I've had conversations with people who have been through the exact same times in their lives and they've survived. And if they, have, and if they haven't survived, they can tell you how they did survive when they lost someone close to them through the death, through suicide. So please, if you're feeling dark and you're feeling alone, don't be alone. S step back and listen. There are, there are people out there who love you and there are people out there who re who, whose hands are reaching out for you to grab. And remember, if you die, there's the emergency number in the US, 988. Please do not be alone. And because this is such a sensitive subject and um, the, the, the conversations are really, really emotional and sensitive on so many levels, I've decided to, I'm not going to make, uh, I'm not going to offer this publicly, but through an opt-in system where you can receive these videos in the comfort of your home and watch them for yourself and as many times as you want to. And then there's always support. Remember, dial 988 and or reach out, comment. There's other people out there who have experienced what you're experiencing and are willing to listen or to reach out a hand, or to just listen or be there with you in silence, even if it is in a virtual space. So many blessings for this time of the year, and many blessings to move through this period and come out in a much better place. Thank you, and um, I'll see you. Just opt in and we'll see you on the other side. Thank you. Remember, this series is not about medical advice or psychological advice. It's just conversations with people who have lived experiences, who have lived through this darkness and survived, who have attempted or, or, or had suicide ideation and have survived. And it's about the people who have been left behind and have learned and survived that too. 
So remember, this is not any medical advice or psychological advice at all. If you dial 988 for support. Thank you. Thank you for being here and many blessings.